Hello everybody, my name is Chania and allow me to beg your indulgence for just one moment as we get on with some downpour from Call of Duty 4, the one game which hasn't been going very well for me so far. However, this game went a little bit better than the average one for me. Uh, well, it would have been considered a pretty average score in the past, but with my current form on Call of Duty 4, I reckon this was pretty reasonable. So, um... I'm going to take a look at what we're going, to, what I'm going to be doing here. I'm going to talk about the game. I know it's so rare to hear a gameplay commentator talk about the game these days, but I am going to. Okay, so I'm coming here. I'm behind the wall. I've got a good line of sight. Oh, I missed him. I was a bit too late. Then I got, I've got him. I put a few shots on him. He's weakened. I'm going to react a bit slowly here. Yeah. Well, at least I was making sure I was on target, I guess. So now I'm seeing that the enemy are spawning. Well, I'm moving to where they're spawning, so I'm moving up here. I can see over there. Get him as he comes over. Had to reload. Had to re-aim thanks to recoil. Unfortunately, I didn't get the double kill there, mainly because of the whole had, having to re-aim thing. Uh, but I've got another plan. I'm coming into this building. So I don't I haven't done in ages, but I should do that. There he is. We taken down. Super cool. Okay. So now we've got the re recon plane. I can see that they may be coming out there. I can see bullets. Oh, oh, I see him in the window, and there you go, son, has some of that. So right now, things are going pretty reasonably, I'm like, okay, so I've basically outfought and outmaneuvered all of them so far. And there's a quick little reload cancel. And um, now I'm thinking, what am I going to do? Okay, so I can see a lot of playing, I can see a lot, of, I can see someone behind me now who could potentially kill me if I go for any to move, moved on. Now I see this guy, oh, nice, nice kill. They're pretty easy, and then I can then I turn around. Oh, look where they're coming out there, and a nice little double. Oh dear, I've made a bit of a mistake here. I'm like, oh no, I've had to relocate, and then that guy. I can't remember if he if he was spawned there or, or what happened exactly, but he was lucky. He got into the right position. I was focused on killing his teammate, who was after me anyway. So it was really just a bit of a bad situation. Flanked. Never mind. You always run that risk when you try and attack. You know, you always run that sort of risk of being now I'm not in a very good position at all because I know he's behind cover I've got a submachine gun and it's a long range fight which is just not the type of thing you want to be doing with your um, submachine guns and my helicopter got shot down by the turrets unfortunately the turrets are on this map so and they they make it a constant uh, problem you know the whole trying to, sh trying to call in the helicopter and have it do a lot of work caught him off using the windows there. The windows are always useful, you know, you've got to remember to shoot out windows and here we go again. Just get him out of the window. Pretty easy and I'm going to perform the classic drop shot. There it is. Well, I should have really been shooting on the way down. I probably would have messed up my aim though, but never mind. So now I'm back into where I where they were spawning the last time. However, it looks like they've all moved off, so I'm now going to have to chase them down. <sighs> Too much chasing and I'm just too long a range really for the submachine gun to be that effective in that scenario. Not really good enough to make the submachine gun work there. Oh look, and he's been killed by my teammate but I'm still looking that way. I should have shot the guy actually I think that was on that roof. Uh, he got killed later by my teammate but I could have had an opportunity there for maybe an assist. Although I might have given away my position so you never really know how things are going to work out in this game. And now I'm picking up the M4 carbine or carbine depending on where you're from. Um, if you're an English speaker, then it's carbine. If you're an American, then it's carbine, for some reason. And I've got a weird bit of frame rate issues. I don't know if that's a, well, that was captured or if my laptop's doing that. But now I'm going to move around the side. I can see him there. Oh, son, he just wasn't ready. And then I'll see him a but he's gone up to the top, so I'm okay. And now I see him behind the built blocks. Do I see him behind the blocks? No, I saw him too late. 
it's weird actually when you watch things back you notice things that you didn't notice when you were actually playing but and now I'm not sure where they were, where they are because I knew they were all close at one point and now I'm going to come up here was this a good idea? I can't remember oh yeah I see the guy over there so I haven't called in my uh, my uh, plane yet and I'm, oh, I'm in trouble here I don't really think I'm going to survive this uh, even when I'm playing the game get stunned so oh my god pull back pull back never mind guy with uh, the right gun and uh, basically now I'm calling in the helicopter I'm doing the old trick of wait till you die first of course the yeah, uh, problem with that is that you are assuming you're gonna die and then like okay right well oh <laughs> unlucky mong child unlucky that was just a bit of a dumbass well it was just unlucky I can't really say it was a dumbass move it was just unlucky <laughs> I wasn't even aiming for him, didn't even expect him, so technically he could have got me by surprise there, but even then I'm pretty good actually when I get taken by surprise, and I normally at least land a few shots and, and every so often we'll take a kill, oh, oh, oh Mong Child again, but there you go, that's what I'm like when I get taken by surprise, that time I went for the knife. Okay, so this time I can see that there's a guy on me, but he's, for some reason he's not attacked, so I'm just like, who is it, oh, and then there's another guy back around here come back around here and it's Mong Child again. That guy must really be hating me by now. <laughs> I've probably frustrated him a lot. And there's a grenade right over the top. But I don't think that's going to get to anybody. And excuse me, I'm going to get rid of the screen that's just popped up on my laptop. Go away. Go away. I can't see what's happening now. Oh, problem with live commentary. Things pop up on laptops. And oh, nice survival. Injured though. And around the side, looking up, so I've healed, and oh, I've got the N16, this is the, this is the fight, and I'm like, I can't call my airstrike, I didn't even realise that an airstrike was on the way, I hadn't even announced it at that point, I don't think, uh, I can't hear it, because I've muted it, so it doesn't conflict with the commentary, there you go, another one right there, you know, this is exactly what the uh, M16 is designed for, okay, so I'm going to bomb him on top of that, I'm going to bomb, bomb the guy on the turret, so I could see he was up there, so I've done that, I've bombed the turret, and now my helicopter's coming in. I'm hoping, and I've, I've called it in right away there because of the fact that we're nearly, nearly over. Uh, the game's nearly finished. And uh, so the helicopter's gone to work, hopefully, and um, obviously I've taken out the guy in the turret, so he can't just immediately take it out. And then I've got just a couple of enemies around now, and I'm just thinking how best to deal with them. Should have killed him a bit, easy, a bit earlier than that but maybe he would have noticed me. Okay, so I can't see him there. I'm like, okay, go around the back. Oh, son. Should have, have actually bothered reloading. Actually, I don't even think I did reload. I think I cancelled it off. But now I can see we're getting close again to the enemy. Throw the grenade. That was a very badly thrown grenade, though. Um, did it kill anybody? No, it was a helicopter. From in there, I thought my grenade actually killed somebody. But it didn't. And I think now it's just the helicopter that does the business. Oh, I'll get killed, so what do you know? And then my helicopter takes one last kill, and that's it, game over. And that was just a pretty pretty um, controlled game, actually, just taking things steady. Scores 33-4. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys later.